assalamu alaikum students i hope you all are fine today we are going to discuss the next type of the mountain that is block mountains now let's discuss in detail block mountains are formed as a result of the uplifting of the earth crust when it is pushed up between two fault lines so block mountains are formed as a result of uplifting of the earth crust between the two fault lines the uplifted block forms block mountains also called a horse block so that this one is a uplifted block so this one is known as horse block mountains in east africa and nevada in the usa are good examples of the block mountains the low lying area between two block mountain formation is called a rift valley so these are the low areas and these are the known as rift valley a good example of this is the rift valley that runs north to south in east africa so this one is example of the rift valley now come towards the blue box that is related to the fault lines as i discussed earlier in the definition fault line fault lines are the deep cracks in the earth crust caused by the difference of speeds in the movement of the earth's tectonic plate so these are the lines that are caused due to the deep cracks and these are the deep cracks that occurs in the earth crust because of the difference of speed in the movement of the earth tectonic plates the earth crust is made up of soft and hard rocks soft rocks rocks compress into fault mountains but hard rocks break or crack under pressure causing fault lines so the soft rock are basically changed into the fault mountain but the hard rocks causing the fault lines such movements also cause earthquakes now come towards the next page now come towards the next page that is related to the next type that is the volcanic mountains volcanic mountains are formed by volcanism and volcanism is a complete process the lava molten rock erupts through cracks in the earth crust successive eruption form a cone shape called a volcano and the mountain is thus called a volcanic mountain successive eruption is that eruption that occurs one after the other and due to this eruption uh, a cone like shape formed that is known as volcano and the mountain in which volcanism occurs is known as volcanic mountain the opening called the vent so this one is a opening and this one is known as a vent is connected to the source of the lava this one is the source of a lava the magma molten rock in the earth's interior so the lava is, and the magma is the molten rock that is present in the earth interior earth interior means in our internal part of the earth the cup like shape at the top of the mountain is called the crater so these are the cup like shapes and these are known as crater when the walls of the crater collapse due to the eruption of lava when these crater collapse with each other due to the eruption of a lava the crater expands these craters expands into a large caldera and sometimes a caldera fills with the rain water to form a caldera lake so due to the large expand expansion of the crater there sometimes a caldera forms and caldera fills up with the rain water and form a caldera lake here volcanic mountains are located in the volcanic island of indonesia hawaii japan sicily etc so these mountains are basically located in these areas mount itna in sicily mount fuji in japan and mount mount kilimanjaro in tanzania are also examples of volcanic mountains here are the few pictures that show the famous mount the perfect one of mount fuji this one is a mount fuji that is uh, present in the japan and a caldera in mount uh, pintabu and philippines so now come towards the exercise the question number 2 define mountains what are the major types of mountain given example of each type so uh, there are basically three major parts of this question now mark one by one the first one is a define mountains come towards the page number 60 and the definition of the mountains here the defi definition starts from mountains are termed as a high relief starts from this line and ends at and narrow at the top so this one is a definition of the second question 
the first part of the second question and the next part is related to the types so these are the three basic types of the mountains now mark these three types now mark the examples of each type firstly mention the heading there fold mountain and then write the examples so the examples of the fold mountains are here the rocky mountains in north america the andes mountains in south america and the uh, atlas mountains in north africa so these are the examples of the fault mountains now come towards the next type that is a block mountain and mark the examples here so the examples related to related to block mountains are these mountains in east africa and navida in the usa are good examples of block mountains so these are the examples of the block mountains now come towards the third type that is a volcanic mountain and the examples of the volcanic mountains are here so the examples mount etna in sicily mount fuji in japan and mount kilimanjaro in tanzania are examples of a volcanic mountain so these are the examples of the volcanic mountain now come towards the question number 4 What is a caldera lake and how is it formed? So the answer is on page number sixty-four. Now come towards the page number sixty-four. So the answer starts from here. The cup-like shape at the top of the mountain is called the crater. When the walls of the crater collapse due to eruption of lava, the crater expands into a large caldera. Sometimes the caldera fills up with rainwater to form a caldera lake. So this one is an is the answer of the question number four. Now come towards the exercise. Choose the correct answer. The Himalayas are located in Asia. The most dominant mountains in the world are fault mountains. Fault mountains are usually located in the middle of continents. The force that push up land into fault is called tectonic force. The rift valley runs from north to south in East Africa. Now come towards question number six. Name these deep cracks in the earth crust caused by speed differences of the earth tectonic plates, and the answer is fault lines. A cone-shaped mountain from which lava erupts, known as volcanic mountain. Cup-like shape at the top of volcanic mountain is known as crater an opening in a volcano is called vent famous volcanic mountain in italy is mount etna famous volcanic mountain in japan is mount fuji famous volcanic mountain in kenya mount kilimanjaro i hope you understand the today's lecture note down on your book and learn it very well take care and allah hafiz